how you all doing so what we're getting up to in this video taking a look at the wiring yes we're almost there nice and tidy got the solenoid in place don't know if you can see behind there but I felt the due place or the CDL unit so that will live in there did most of the wiring off film because it's uh, not very interesting to watch so what else are we doing putting this tire on this wheel fitting this chain fitting this sprocket onto this carrier oh not this sprocket this sprocket's knackered don't know if you can tell but it will be told better that way it's all hooked up so I'll be fitting this sprocket onto this carrier and this sprocket is perfectly splendid fitting this brake disc onto this wheel and then fitting this wheel into the bike so let's get on with it so first let's fit the chain right so we got this nice shiny chain from eBay for 13 pound with postage which is a bargain believe you me I think it was 18 pound free postage make an offer so I offered 13 and it was accepted but uh, there's no split link in this because uh, with super bikes you're not supposed to have those little push on slip links because the chain can come up and rip round your neck and uh, I haven't got a chain linking tool so rather than uh, ruining this with a screwdriver and a hammer to try and separate it I'm going to keep it as one big circle and take the swing arm off so I can get it on take this swing arm off what could possibly go wrong? there's only two bolts there's only two bolts there's only two bolts right then let's see if we can get this thing on its centre stand So we're going to have to try and drag the whole thing forward. That'll be fun, won't it? Let's try that. Oh, we're on. We're on the centre stand. We can get rid of the paddock stand. then so now we're on the center stand we can get the swing arm off and there is one bolt there and one bolt underneath just here so let's see if we can get those out and get the chain on without doing any damage to the swing arm the frame or the chain right let's try the underneath bolt first Okay, so that's the bolt out but yes that's that one out right then, let's try the big one Very good for your back. Tap that through. Could we fit our thing underneath? Stick that under there. Okay, let's pull the bolt out. He says. Just use the screwdriver from the other side to knock it through. Come on baby. 
See we go, that's that one out. Right, let's see if we can pull it out. No, we can't. Oh my god. It's not as easy as you thought, Johnny. Oh, all right, me up. Forgot about this bar on the back of the swing arm. They're gonna have to take this shock out. Shocking. So maybe it was three volts. So let me do the top bolt now. Oof. I think you can see it there then. What's going to happen when I pull the bolt out? I think this is going to be pretty heavy. prepared as we can. There's the bolt. And I think we're still stuck. <laughs> yes, we're still stuck. We're going to have to take the shot completely out. Perfect. Phew, it's only two bolts, he says. Right, so I want to get this chain on the uh, right way. It came off the other bike. And uh, the way I'm guessing to do that is there is the uh, original split link, which somebody must have done from the outside of the bike. So if we keep that on the outside, we should be okay. Remember to keep our link on the outside. Sorry, it's a bit dark, but the light's a bit weird. If we look that over there, then we've got to get this. Around there. Then we've got to get the chain behind this and uh, through this. And that doesn't look too easy, but uh, let's see how we go. Come on, baby. Oh, yes. Perfect. Whew. It's only two bolts, he says. Whew, so I'm happy with that, so leave this with me and I'll get it all back together and then I'll be back to you. Okay, so there we are, all back together, all bolted up, all torqued down, all that just to get this chain on. I don't know what you're all going to say, why didn't you just buy the splain chitter? Uh, chit <laughs> yeah, why didn't you just buy the, the splain chipper? <laughs> so anyway, let's get this sprocket on before we uh, lose the chain somewhere. Okay, so that goes on there. Says. Please don't say I've got the wrong chain. <laughs> Come on. That's it. Whoa, beautiful. Lovely. Then we want. That in there, put the bolt back in. Do it good and tight. What's that on there? Yeah, we've got to fit this little gizmo thing. First, but before I put the cover on, I want to put the uh, water pump on, but I'm not doing that yet because I've got to clean it up and uh, 
paint it cherry red to match this and that when that's on. But they were just to leave that like that or paint that red as well. Yeah, you could drop it in the comments if you want. If you did, comment. Should I leave that silver or paint it red like these? Anyway, what next? Right then, so let's install the valve. Take the valve cap off. Take the little shiny bit off. Let's stick that bit in the wheel. I'm going to put a bit of this on the rubber. Just to help it slide in. Okay, so we just push it into the hole. We can uh, put our little tool on there. Screw that on there. Then we should be able to pull. driving
grease everything up and get the wheel in the bike. Oh, I'm mad glad that's done. So there you go, back wheel in. Now I can stick the bars on and push it outside and have a good sweep up. Don't worry about the wheel bearings. I know I didn't show very much detail in this video, but don't worry. Check the video, what's coming out on Wednesday. CBR 1000F rear wheel bearings replacement. So there you go, you've just watched Road Road at Mr. Law. I'm John. Who are you? What's your name? Where you're from? Anyway, I'll see you on Wednesday. I've seen a lot of change, been through a lot of pain. Some things are not the same as they were a year ago. But all will be okay. I move on each and every day. The past is where it stays, way back a year ago. I've changed for the better this time I thought I would never be fine I strive just to say I'm alright And for the first time in a long time I'm alright I've seen a lot of change Been through a lot of pain Some things are not the same as they were a year ago But all will be okay I move on each and every day The past is where it stays Way back a year ago